Yo, 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 Ruth the Lucario here, and welcome to Leo Me Sporkin. Well, welcome back to Little Miss Fortune. Just wait until you go inside. <laughs> oh, I like the sound of that. Oh, I have a question. What does this sign mean? Oh, I don't know. Sparkle? Ah, cool. I don't so, trust you. Whenever you're ready. Oh, I can't wait to see the magic inside. something I'm not sure what's this the hamster party a magical hamster party I know you love parties <laughs> do I <laughs> can we go inside I don't know let's go find out Whoa, hamster fight are you going to do something about it That's blood. Oh, are those wings? Maybe I should try one so I can keep my breath fresh. I'm a little lady, you know. Wow, I'm feeling really nice. Those are drugs.
and I'm into refreshment at all. <laughs> Are you all right, Miss Fortune? I'm okay. Check that lady out. I think she's in trouble. Oh, no. I think I recognize her. She's the owner of the club back there. Really? Yes. Looks like she was robbed. Oh, I bet it was that hamster with the black mask. Yes, you're right. Excuse me. I think I have your purse. Go easy on the mint, though. I tried one and it was a wild ride. Is that for me? What is it? That's your reward for returning the bag. A VIP ticket for the club. I get to put it inside the club? <laughs> yes, and one step closer to the eternal happiness. <laughs> That's a win-win for me. Yes, you could say that. Am I allowed to bounce? Of course you are. <laughs> Sweet. Listen, Miss Fortune, you need to find the white rabbit. A white rabbit? Why? It will lead you closer to the eternal happiness. Okay, I'll find it. Excuse me, can you let me through? Hmm, okay. Oh no, Stony! What are you doing? This is not the time. What's happening? It looks like this hamster challenged Stony to a dance battle. No, we don't have time for this. I'm sorry, but it's on. Rock and roll, Stony. <laughs> Happiness is still out there. 
Don't you want it? Oh, yes, I really want it. Let's go. I'm sure this is all just a trick. Look, the white rabbit. Follow it. Yes. Hey, you, on the other side of the screen, listen. I know it must be hard not knowing much about our little lady's future. Will misfortune really die? If so, how will she die? And when will the evil fox kill her? Will she find the eternal happiness? I personally hope she does. <clears throat> Act normal. She's coming. <laughs> oh, Miss Fortune, you made it. Congratulations. Thank you. Where are we? We're one step closer to the grand prize of eternal happiness. Great, because I'm not allowed to be outside this lake, you know. Don't worry, it's not far from here. Great. <laughs> okay. Look, a missing kid. I don't like this. Maybe I should go back home. Bye. Don't go now, Miss Fortune. I can protect you. Really? Yes. All right, then. <laughs> Hello. <gasps> Look, it's Benjamin from the Hoots in the Woods. <laughs> you know, if you ever want to hang out or something, I'm available. Don't engage with that wild fox. I told you, foxes are dangerous. Let me handle this. Benji, are you a wild, dangerous fox? <laughs> no, Benji, don't go! Let that wild beast run off. I don't want anything bad happening to you. All right. Misfortune. What? Language. Ah. Does this actually have happened to someone in real life? Mr. Voice? Yes, Misfortune. Has anyone reached the end of the game and gotten the eternal happiness? Yes, of course. They lived happily ever after. That sounds nice. You know? I want to win this prize for my mommy. I wish I could give her some help. Get all the hay dolls. Who doesn't work with her? Oh, that's really sweet. Thank you. Would you like to try my sparkle? That's not necessary. Ha, don't be silly. Here you go. Happiness to Mr. Voice. Oh well. Thank you. This Mr. Anyway, voice fella is probably trying to trick you into doing something you shouldn't, yeah. little girl. Mm. Kevin's dad. Who's that? He used to sit in the sandbox next to school. He didn't have any clothes on, and the police officer beat him with a stick. Fascinating. Remember that fish you picked up earlier? You mean Rodrigo? My fish friend forever? You should give it to the seagull. I'm sure it would appreciate some company. Hmm, I guess that maybe that will be a fair thing to maybe do, I guess. I will keep the fish. If you want a fish friend forever, you need to find your own. Rodrigo is my responsibility. That's very mature of you, Miss Fortune. Check out that duck. Let's just go, Miss Fortune. You don't want to get involved with ducks. <laughs> Be silly. Ducks are pretty cool. And look, he's carrying a boombox. This could be my opportunity to finally dance for real. Would you like to show me some of your dance moves? Nah, I have 
even practice for a while. <laughs> I leave it to the pros. Oh, cute. Cool dancing. Oh. I'm okay. I'm okay. What are you talking about? That was normal. Oh, if you say so. Would you like to write this one? It's like a tornado. <laughs> yes, I want to ride. My God, stop! Ah, I can't hold that anymore! <laughs> oh no, misfortune. Last challenge awaits at the pet cemetery. A pet cemetery? That sounds like the best place to end the game. Exactly my thoughts. I'm glad you feel the same way. <laughs> So, I was thinking while we're walking, mind if I ask you a couple of questions? Sure, I'm pretty good at answering questions. Great, just answer as honestly as you can. All right. First question, have you ever stolen anything? No, never. Never? Good for you. Second question, are you happy right now? Yes, I mean, nothing bad is happening right now. That makes me happy. Well then, the last question. Do you feel loved? I'm pretty sure mommy loves me because she hasn't left me. Thank you for your honesty. You're welcome. <laughs> Look, we arrived at the pet cemetery. Ready to find the prize of eternal happiness. Yes, where is it? I have hidden it in one of the graves. I have to dig in a grave? Which one? I'll give you a hint. It's where the goldfish is buried. The goldfish, all right. Must I dig with my tiny hands? Yikes forever. No, use the shovel. What shovel? This shovel. That shovel, okay. It says, Mr. Bubbles. Hmm. Yes, that's gotta be the one. Congratulations, Miss Fortune. You found the prize. <gasps> Really? Yes! You see the little box? Open it. Oh, okay. Exciting. Is this the prize? But there's only a note. What? Yes, it says, I stole your eternal happiness. Sign, Benjamin. It didn't! My eternal happiness. I knew the fox was trouble. He stole your prize. What a disappointment. 
I really wanted to surprise Mummy with this. What should I do now? We must find the fox and get your happiness back. I'm sure he hasn't gone far away. Let's go find him. Yes, let's do that. Ah, oh, such a letdown. <gasps> Look, there he is, Benjamin. Did you steal my eternal happiness? Not cool. Come on, Benjamin. Give me back my happiness. Run after him. We can't let the fox get away again. He stole your prize. Benjamin really disappointed me. Children in pain? Oh. Did you find something, Miss Fortune? No, you're imagining things. We should keep our eyes open in case we see the fox. They know how to hide. All right. like where the fox would hide the prize. You mean I should go down there? Yes, don't worry. Nothing bad will happen. Nothing bad at all. Okay. You sound very sure. I'll trust you. Benjamin will steal my prize. Maybe he's not happy himself. But I need that happiness myself. And for mommy. Hello? Anybody down there? Oh, that was a pretty big fall. <laughs> Hello? Mr. Voice, are you there? It looks like there's somebody else behind us. Hello? It looks like there's somebody else behind us. Hello? repellent? I can't deny the bottle sweet style. I'll take it. into. She's such a mess. Maybe it was a mistake choosing her for this. I mean, I saw her eating glitter. Who does that? It's not natural. Uh. Miss Fortune, you're alive and well. That's great. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Where am I? What happened? You sprayed fox repellent on yourself and passed out. There was quite a lot of vomit, too. Ew, yikes forever. That didn't go as I planned. <laughs> we still need to find a fox and take back the eternal happiness. 
Maybe we could find out where he lives. Yes. Give me a minute to figure this out and I'll get back to you. Okay, I'll just hang around. Oh, the zoo. You know, with the animals? I actually made a quick Google search. I found out that the fox has a cousin in the zoo. Oh, really? We could go and see if he knows where the fox lives. But how do we get to the zoo? It's like really far away. Why, we take the bus, of course. There should be a bus stop nearby. Ah, uh, okay. Hi, you look familiar. What? Got me. I got to play inside all night until a security man found me. He thought I was a raccoon. <laughs> well, that sounds like it was a fun night for you. Yeah, except for me crying a lot, but it was fun. Is this for me? A lottery ticket? Cool, thank you. Well, have a look. Is it a winner? Maybe next time. Look, even more missing children posters. So many. I wonder what they're missing. Oh, don't you worry about them. I'm sure they will all turn up one day. You think so? Of course. I don't know, Mr. Voice. This is starting to smell mysterious. Here we are. Have you ever taken the bus all by yourself before? No, I haven't. I'm not sure what to do. Do I need a ticket? Let's find out. There's an information board. It says that all children under 15 years old can ride the bus for free. I'm eight, so I'm good. Great. Hmm, now that I think about it, maybe you'll need a bus ticket. You sound old. Uh, I'm definitely older, but nobody can see me. Ah, uh, okay. Are you like 20? Yes, more or less. Ah. Uh. To wait two minutes. Yikes forever. I can't wait to meet Benjamin's cousin at the zoo. I'm gonna tell how badly Benjamin behaved and that Benjamin should be ashamed. That sounds great. <laughs> should I sit down and wait? Do as you please. Okay, thank you. I'll sit. I'm a bit tired from all the walking, you know. I can imagine. You have very small feet. <laughs> yes, I'm a little lady. That's what I am. Check those old ladies out. They're a little scary, don't you think? Honestly, I've seen worse. Really? Yes. You know, my mommy also uses the thing. Of she likes to hide her smile and tears behind it. Would you like to have a mask like that? Nah, uh, maybe. I don't know. The 
bus is here. Hmm. This bus trip might take a while. Are you okay with that? It's okay. Hiro is keeping me company. Who is Hiro? He's my friend from Japan. He's a ghost, you know. He's always saying, Kiriba do kudasuka. <laughs> You're really funny, Miss Fortune. There is no such thing as ghosts. Kiriba do kudasuka. Hey, Miss Fortune, look. There's a bunch of cows on the field. Oh, I love cows. I think we're getting close to the zoo now. Okay, great. Wow, here we are. I can't wait to go inside. You have the ticket, right? What ticket? Oh, didn't I give you a ticket earlier? What? No, you didn't. Oh dear, I'm sorry. I totally forgot. Do you have any ideas on how to get inside? You know, without paying. Hmm. I saw mommy showing her boobies to the guy in the store when she got some free food. But I haven't got any titties yet, so that might not work. I see. Well, I have an idea. What if we use diversion? Hmm. What does di diversion mean? Well, make the cashier look somewhere else, you know. Fool him. Okay, let me think what I can do. Hello, can I get inside for free? Huh, I guess not. Okay, this is breakable, like, like with a rock or something, like, like a stone. Any tickets to the zoo? Ew, yucky. No tickets, only yucky. Huh, they know about the missing children here. Hmm, I think I came up with an idea. What if... I'll tell a lie so he believes it. A lie, Miss Fortune? Are you sure you want to do this? Yes, I mean, that's the only way to get inside, trust me. All right, let's go. Hello, excuse me. There's one of the missing children at the bus stop. I just saw her. You may want to go and check it out. <laughs> Thank you. Yes, it worked. Isn't this wonderful? We'll get to see so many caged animals. <laughs> caged animals? By the way, you did a great job not getting caught by the vendor. Very impressive. Ah, uh, thank you. <laughs> but now, we should find out where the wolf exhibit is. Why? You mean Benjamin's cousin is a wolf? Yes. Remember, he knows where the fox lives. All right. Look, birdie nom nom. <laughs> What? What did you just say to me? Give yourself a fuck! Oh, Miss Fortune, watch that mouth. I don't care. This bird is mean. Oh dear. We need to get your happiness back as soon as possible. You know, I'm feeling really annoyed. Like a lot. What's happening to me? 
I smell hormones waking up inside you. What? Hormones? No. Hormones. Ah, oh, okay. What's that? Your body's preparing to create life inside you. You get a lot of new feelings that are completely normal. Ah, oh, okay. And you'll bleed for three to five days from your vagina. Ew, yikes forever. You will also suffer each month for many, many years. And society treats you like garbage. Are you for real? Yes, I am. I think I need some emergency glitter. <laughs> ah, so much better. Wait, Miss Fortune. We don't know where the wolf is. Maybe we can find a map or something. To find the wolf, you say? Yes, Miss Fortune. Ah, okay. those sweet flashes. They could be all my babies. Don't get too attached to those toys. Don't worry. I'm just looking. I wish I could write Japanese so I could send a cute postcard to my friend Hira. But where does a ghost live? Stop lying, Miss Fortune. Ghosts are not real. You're just jealous because you don't have a ghost friend. There are coins at the bottom of the fountain. Yes, those are people's wishes. Can one pay for wishes? People nowadays think they can buy everything with money. I wish I could throw a coin and ask for my happiness back. Also, the Benjamin transform into a good foxy because I would totally go out on a date with him if he was good. Hmm. Are you done here, Miss Fortune? Yeah. <laughs> So much to see and do. Find the wolf area so we know where to go. I think the zoo is about to close. There, you see? That the wolf be. Great job. Let's hurry up now. This looks like the way to the wolf. Yes. Let's go then. Oh my. Looks like this area is closed to the public. Oh, damn it. You will have to sneak past the janitor to get to the other side. Don't let her see you. Otherwise, she will lock you in and call your mummy. Ah, uh, don't worry. I'm like a sweet little ninja. I could hide behind those boxes, right? Great idea. Hide behind a box until she turns her back to you. All right, I'm ready. Let's do this. Oh. Like a little ninja lady. Well done, Miss Fortune. Now, wait for her to turn her back to you and... And then kill her from behind? What? No. Why? That's what the ninjas do in movies. I've seen, like, all of them. Don't tell mommy. Well, this isn't a movie, so just do as I say. When she turns around, you can jump out and keep moving. Ah, uh, all right then. It just looks a lot cooler on TV. Oh. I'm like the shadow ninja master. She never saw me. Don't celebrate just yet. There's one more box you have to sneak past. You better watch me when I nail this one. Oh, I made it. Little Ninja Lady is the best. Well done. <laughs> Thank you. Nobody's us coming. You really proved your ninja skills back there, Miss Fortune. But I'm pretty sure I was the best at hiding back there. No, that doesn't count. You're not a little lady like me. You're just a boy. Oh, you'll see. I'm much, much more than that. However, now you should go and meet the wolf. Got it. 
Meet the wolf, maybe pet it, and get Benjamin's address, like a ninja. Look, there's a note. It must say where the fox lives. We need to take it. Uh, I can reach it from here. We need to find a key to open the cage. I'll find that key. You'll see. Do you think there could be a key in there? I don't know. Let's go and see. Quietly. Like a little ninja, got it. Like little lady misfortune, the ninja lady. Lady has entered the room. We need to find a key now. I told you already. I'll find it. You'll see. Watch and learn how to find a key. Is there a key in here? Cool. Another doll. What's that? Nothing. Secret inside? I'm free. Any keys inside the bucket? But you know, these boots are made for walking, and that's just what they'll do. Miss Fortune, focus. Okay, okay. I'll check those pockets. Mm, look, I found a paper with some numbers on it. Keep it. It might be helpful. Okay. find some information in here about the key? Sure. I don't see why not. Check out my computer skills. I bet the password is this one. Wait, Miss Fortune. I think you're holding the paper upside down. Don't interrupt me. I know what I'm doing. Keep quiet. Oh, yeah. Miss Fortune Ramirez Hernandez is a computer scientist. You really surprise me. <laughs> a private shot. <laughs> Let's see what it says. Very impressive. <laughs> Thank you.
Wolfie? Ah, oh, damn it. What scared him away? Why can't the little lady respect the wolf? Oh, that was unexpected. Not to me. Animals usually run away from me. That's too bad. But hey, the note is right there. I'm gonna take it. It says, my evil cousin's address. Fox, Cooks, Deacon, 15. Open fields. It's Benjamin's address. Good. Now we can get that stolen happiness back. All right, sweet. It looks like the fastest way to the Fox is by boat from Phantasmagoria. Wait a minute. Are you telling me we are going to Phantasmagoria? It seems that way, yes. Sweet. I always wanted to go, yes! <laughs> Are you up for another round of questions while we walk? Sure. My question answering skills are all warm up. Great. Great. And, as usual, just be honest and you'll do fine. <laughs> First question. Have you ever heard this question before? Yes. All right. Second question. Have you ever lied to a friend? I swear. Whatever you say, Miss Fortune. Now, for the last question. Have you ever seen someone die? Other than in ninja movies? No. <laughs> they die in funny ways in ninja movies. Don't tell mommy. I won't. Thank you for your honesty again, Miss Fortune. <laughs> You're welcome. We're getting really close to Phantasmagoria now. Yeah, I can hear. <laughs> Exciting. And I think I'm going to leave this one here. That was fun.